um, I work with Native Americans of North America quite a bit. And of all the tribes that I've come across, the Hopi seem to exude aloha more than any. Yes. Now, one of my friends was, uh, when I met him, was about 108. And that was his grandfather, uh, Menangri. And I asked him where the Hopi came from. Now, you may know that the, their legend says they came from a hole at the bottom of the Grand Canyon. It's one of them, right. But he said they came from the South Sea, an island in the South Sea. I've, I've heard this also. Uh, there are among the Hopi, there are different versions of their origin. And some of the Hopi, like you just mentioned, say that they came from the Pacific Ocean. And they are one of the few who have an adventurer shaman tradition, which is one that's not so much, for the healing is not so much based on a warrior point of view as it is what we call an adventurer point of view, which is more aloha. Is there anything in the Hawaiian uh, legends that would suggest that people left from Polynesia or from here Oh, well, yes, of course. Uh, for that's very well known. Uh, the, um, let's take, for instance, among the Maori people. The Maori legend is that they came from Hawaii. Now, the problem is they don't like to agree on where Hawaii was. So there are some of the Maori who say that meant Hawaii, and they left from South Point on Big Island. And they point out, and there are Maori who come every year in a pilgrimage to that place where they took off. We know that there was a great emigration at one point when Hawaiian Islands were invaded from the south, and that Polynesians scattered everywhere. We also know that these were the greatest navigators in the world. And they navigated everywhere. Uh, I have found... Uh, uh, histories and records of a Polynesian settlement in Cabo San Lucas that was there when the Spanish arrived. And these were Polynesian people, and they, it's you know, recorded in their histories and recorded in their museums in Mexico. Uh, the Peruvian government says that the original Peruvians came from Polynesia. We have a lot, there are a lot of cultural similarities and ties with the Northwest Coast Indians of Canada. Uh, and then, over in Micronesia, there's all kinds of islands that are called outliers, which are inhabited by Polynesians in the middle of Micronesia. And they're always the best woodcarvers. So we've got all kinds of indications. You know, people try to say, well, all these people came to the Pacific. These were the navigators, folks. These were the people who knew how to sail anywhere, and they did it. And they sailed everywhere. There are no Polynesian stories of having come from someplace else. Mm -hmm. 